Hey everybody, it's your friend Sarm right here, and we're back with another episode of Dave the Diver. I hope you're having a fantastic and amazing day today. To start off here, we had a dinner service. We have all of our food picked out already. We got some good marlin food going. We got a marlin and soybean paste roast for our initial dish here. And then some marlin sushi, yellowfin tuna kami. We got some puffer nikogori, white trevally kombu okazuki, and then the Humboldt squid sushi. And then the Starry Skate Sushi. So we're going to go for uh, price in this one, more over taste, because we got the taste finished in the last episode. So let's go ahead and get this open and get to some serving. So remember, we're only doing a partial service this evening because we did our dive in the last episode, which ended up uh, being a big shark fight, which is pretty cool. So we got that all taken care of. Keep our eyes peeled for uh, any tips and stuff that we can pick up here. Picking up some dishes, get some extra money from that. It's always good. Keep our eye on the wasabi. Looks like I'm gonna head over there right away now. Gotta keep that going for sure. Let Raul get that plate and grab one of these. Head on over. Go ahead and get this cleaned up and that's probably gonna be it for this evening's service. Let's see how we did. Cookstar rank goes up a little bit more, of course, and a pretty profitable evening. So 4,000 coins added to our collection here. Let's go on and progress to the next day. The VIP visits this afternoon. I have to enter the cave with an outflowing current to turn on the second control room switch. Is there any way to enter the cave? The current may be weaker today. I should go check. Check the control room entrance. The fishmon this week, as detected by the radar, is a jellyfish with some kind of wizard hat? That can't be a real jellyfish. Goodness, do you doubt the accuracy of our fish radar? It was a very difficult task detecting this jellyfish with our radar. The reason was, this jellyfish teleports around at incredible speeds. It'll disappear as soon as you go near. You'll probably won't be able to catch it unless you have something like a sniper rifle. About 100 meters underwater, near the yellow shipwreck. That's what my information says. Now then, keep up the good work. Okay, the crops have grown. It is the VIP D-Day event, and that was the VIP versus Boncho, so that's gonna happen this evening. So let's go ahead and head on down and see if we can get through to find the second device. Okay, here we are pulling up on the tunnel with the current that we have to try and fight and see what happens here. There must be a second switch somewhere inside, but the strong current is blocking access. What should I do? Oh, oh look who it is. It's our little buddy. Aren't you supposed to be back at the village, guy? The beluga, what are you doing here? It's dangerous, go back. Oh, okay. I mean, right on your back. The beluga could swim against the current. Will it be okay? We'll find out, Dave. Maybe I should grab on here. Oh, wait! Okay, in this cave, you can move around with the beluga. Press left control to destroy obstacles. Okay, okay. Ooh. We got a little shrimp guy here. I wonder if we can catch things. Yep, yes we can. Okay, the beluga can eat that. So, I I feel like the map is just moving by itself here. Let's see if I, yeah, so I gotta keep up with it. I'm not sure what, I feel like if I fall behind, we're gonna be in trouble here. What's gonna happen? Okay. We can dodge these pretty simply. Okay, well, we'll try that again. Okay, got those easily now. Carrying on, we break through here. Those guys are in hot pursuit, holy cow. Okay, we're doing great now. Looks like we got some more current. Jump on that. Ooh. Got the shrimp 
for health. Heck yeah. Getting a little ahead of myself there being on the right side of the screen. Just can't see what's coming up. Oh boy, a giant jellyfish. Oh, is this a mommy jellyfish? No, it's a... Oh, okay. Phantom jellyfish. Okay. I'm gonna guess that's the weak point. We'll find out. No, we didn't come to hunt small fish. It looks all riled up. I must calm it down. I can't use a weapon in this state. What? Okay, let's see what we got going on here. So we should still be able to do that. Yep, no problem. Okay, we got a little current action now. How do we hurt this guy? Okay, can I get can I get in there? Let's see. <laughs> yes, okay, there we go. We have a health right below us here, so we're, we should be okay for a minute. Dodge these guys. Hopefully. There we go. Okay. It's kind of hard to aim. <laughs> All right, we got him. All right. A couple more little uh, little things he's here. Okay. We can kite those easily. Nice. All right, let's see if this is it. Easy, easy. It's out of here. Okay. Woo, lucky me. It went away. Oh, but we got a uh, tentacle, it looks like. Let's go ahead and grab that. The back door is open. Let's go through it. Can we get this? Oh, yeah. That must be the switch. Should I activate it? Well, yeah, Dave, that's why we're here. Ancient contraption. Nice, there we go. Only one more switch to go. Machinery operating outside. The door is open. Maybe it leads outside. All right, let's head through. Thanks, Beluga. We'll see you later. Oh, I feel less heat than before. Maybe I can go down now. Oh, all right. Check the control room entrance. Ancient control room. Okay, so we got to get out of this little uh, nook and cranny thing. And then we're gonna go ahead and head down as deep as we can go and maybe we can see then we're going to see what happens we'll be back in just a second all right here we are heading down and down down into the depths where it got hot before and we couldn't go any deeper holy moly are these ancient creatures they must have been released from the melting glacial ice i wonder if those are any of use to bombsho for his sushi place i'll bring him some samples if i catch any of them Okay, so we got some new critters here. I don't have the... Uh, I got some good weapons, of course. We got our, um... Uh, we, got our, we got our grenade launcher here, but let's try and get some of these guys. Quigniminimus is the first one we got. Okay, cool. And here is the entryway, it looks like. We need to activate one more device for the door to open. Let's look for a cave that might have the third switch. All right, so that's what we're going to do. We can look for that cave, see if we can find it around here. But yeah, this is the area that we couldn't get to before. It looks... Whoa. Okay, so besides that thing, did you see that tail that's over here? I got three rounds left uh, in my grenade launcher. I'm not going to engage that thing if I can help it. Let's go ahead. We'll check over here first. Oh, a little shrimp guy.
Wapita. Okay, cool. There's another one right there. Excellent. Let's grab this box. Little O2. Perfect. Okay, and then we got a mirror. Oh, what? There's a lot of bizarre critters in here. Okay, so we got more ammo. Fantastic. We need to utilize that for sure. But let's uh, let's go ahead and head back over in here. We got the three rounds. Uh, I want to utilize them so we don't waste anything here. Let's go ahead and we'll swim back in this area. Okay, here we are. We got this guy and... Oh, this thing's aggressive too, apparently. So, yeah, let's see if we can engage this... Uh, oh, that's a... Uh, oh, I know, a, a donkey. Uh, uh, what's the name of the thing? What? Okay, um, we're gonna run away. I it, it just deflected our attack. Okay, um, yeah. <laughs> Let's see if we can get out of... Okay, yeah, get out of here, dude. Okay, so we are gonna grab, um, this ammo that's over here. And then we're gonna go back over in that direction. Okay, so we just fought one of those, uh, green things with the, uh, the little antenna thingy. Uh, it poisoned us big time, so we are not looking very good. Uh, we got a trap down over in here. We gotta be very careful here. We gotta find some, we gotta find some air. Uh, so that's my box. I put, I put that there some time ago. So we just gotta be careful. We gotta avoid that thing. I gotta find some air. Because we're at 6002 right now, so we just gotta be, oh, thank you, game. Thank you. Okay, here we go. Let's grab this. Okay, so now we got more ammo down there. That's great. Let's go back up here. And I want to investigate what this thing that's hiding is. Let's catch this little guy first. This guy right here. Is this a skate? Let's find out. Oh. It's like a horseshoe crab looking thing. Ah, uh, okay. Let's see. Let's see what it is. Sure. Cool. Okay, so maybe a horseshoe crab. I'm not really sure what the, uh, the other names for a horseshoe crab is. Fuck bean. All right, cool. Okay, so let's head back down over this way as we were. We'll grab this ammo. Let's check this weapon crate. I've just been disassembling these for the most part. Ooh, level two. That's what we got right now. So I did purchase a, an upgrade for our weapon um, in the the shop before we came down. Let's grab this weapon. Uh, this ammo. What are those tadpole-like creatures? Are they an ancient species as well? What a cute bunch. What a rare opportunity. I should take a picture. Okay, let's do that then. Oh, what? Take a picture of the four creatures at once. Easy peasy. All right, okay, so we do have more ammo here. Great. And then we have another one of these guys. So I've been gathering them because I got a pick and there's usually a little shrimp buddy that comes out or a sea dragon. There's one. Let's see what we got. got the ruby. It'll take a second because there was four rubies. There it is. The ruby sea dragon. Okay. So nothing over here besides some good stuff. So yeah, I'll bring him back until I figure out where we need to go here. Okay. Here we are. I'm guessing this is it. We got Suam down here. Let's see what he's up to. So, what are you doing here? Well, I came all the way here as the heat under the glacial area has been reduced. I can't fully trust humans like you. So I, the hero of the sea people who defeated the giant Gadon, came here to activate the thing myself. But I need your help because the inside is quite a mess now. Oh yeah? How messy. You will see for yourself. Alright. Uh, I do want to go in there, but let's just take a quick peek down over here. See what we got going on here. We got a crate. Let's check this out. Always worth it to check these things. A, a, a baseball? Okay. Um, seven. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna keep the pick. We're gonna keep the pick because we've been finding some rare stuff. Let's grab these little uh, scrippy guys and then we'll be right back up there. All right, into the uh, entrance we go. Are you ready to enter? Yep. Um, there's no water up here. This is near the roots of the divine tree. They are sucking the ground heat. As the tree has mutated, it seems to have absorbed everything, leaving the soil around it completely dry. I need to open the inner waterway to fill the water again, but I can't reach the contraption up there as it is not in the water. Human, you go up there and activate the contraption on my signal. 
You want me to go up there? Of course. You can't go up there. All right. Wait a moment. Here you can switch between Dave and Suwam. Choose a character that fits the situation to clear the path. Interesting. Okay. We are Suwam right now. Interesting. Okay, so let's hit uh, tab to switch to Dave. Oh yeah, our buddy Dave. Let's go ahead and hit this switch. Okay, that's going to open this passageway. But I bet you have to stay standing on there to keep the passage open. And we'll get Suwam through here and... Okay, we can dash with uh, left shift here with Suwam. Don't need to worry about oxygen with Suwam. Man, this guy is fast in the water. Okay, we'll dodge these things that are flying at us. Swim up here. Okay. I'll bet you we need to do this. Okay, we'll rotate that. That's going to open the passageway. Okay, so we need to hang out here. So we'll hold that, and then we'll switch back to Dave. Can we go underneath this? Oh, yeah. Dodge that, dodge that. Made it. Okay, checkpoint. Great. Let's see what this does. Rotate that guy. Now Suwam can swim through there. Let's carry on with Dave for a minute. Alright, and that's the end of the line for Dave. Let's swap. Dart through here, easy peasy. Do a little rotation there. Okay, there's the path for Dave, and then we can go down with Suam here. Oh, we can't. Okay. Let's swap back to Dave. Go through here. Oh, okay, we'll have to be speedy. Oh, Dave. Uh, I was gonna see if we could make it, but I didn't want to find out. <laughs> Apparently we lost a, a health at one point here. Oh yeah, we got hit by that thing that was falling. Oh, oh. Is he talking? Should be able to sneak through there. Here we go. Easy. Okay, let's hit this. It should allow Suwam to get through here. Hopefully. Okay, we'll rotate that since Dave is through. And then we'll head this way. Okay, let's we'll swim down. I watch those falling things. Nice, okay. Let's wait till this goes to see what we got here. Alright, made it pretty easily. We can go underneath here. Okay, we got another lever. That should allow Dave to waddle across. Swap back to Dave. Okay, we got a reflection mirror up top there. All right. I'll grab this guy. Hmm, but I can't crawl through here, so... Oh, I can drop it, though. Okay, so we'll do that. And then we'll bring Dave about right here, because this looks like I might be able to elevate with it. And then we'll go like that. So let's see, that seed should be right over here. Excellent. Drop that in. Shoot our laser beam. Should melt that. Okay, and then we got another switch right here. And just as I thought, that's gonna elevate Dave. And allow our laser through. Okay, so let's switch back to Dave. And this will probably bring that down. 
Allowing a laser through to melt that. Very good. That's gonna lift the water somehow. Okay, and now we should be able to go through here. Uh, we got this thing. Let's pull that down. Ah, uh, okay. Passageway for Dave, and then we'll grab this. Oh, maybe not. Swap back to Dave. Let's get over this little area first. Okay, we're going to have to do this together, I bet. There's a lever here. There you are. Pull that lever. There's another one down here. I'll pull this one myself. Send me a signal when you're ready. Okay. There we go. Adding more water. The water began to flow from the top. It looked like an important device and is filling the place with water. You hold it without knowing what it does? I trust my gut feeling, you know? The water is filling up. I must suit up. There seems to be a path inside. Let's go. Fortunately, this path is filled with water. This place is packed with divine tree branches. Is there something stimulating the tree? This level of growth is not normal. I need to enter the control room to figure out what's what. We move to the inner switch, human. Follow me. From this point, you can control both Dave and Suwam at the same time. Suwam has the ability to open the tube worm path and penetrate through sea currents by using dash. Help Dave reach the destination safe. Okay. Oh boy. Okay, so okay, this is gonna be a little tricky. Ow. <laughs> okay, uh so Dave is WASD and then Sumum is arrow keys. Let's do this. So now they're on the correct side for our what our keyboard is. Alright, we'll use Suwam's ability here. Okay, we'll scoot over and we'll stack them. There we go. This is... Why is this so difficult? <laughs> Alright, we got that. Alright. Okay, we'll go like that. We'll get Dave in position. Get Suam in position. Trolls. Nice. Okay. And then we need somebody here and somebody here. I'll get Dave and then Suam. This is really cool. <laughs> you can do that. You can control both characters like this. Okay, so. Hmm. So Suam can get through the current. So let's have Dave open this one. And let's get Suam through here. Okay, we got that. So if we go back here, that should allow us to do this. All right, we got that. Easy peasy. Send Dave up top. Checkpoint. All right. Okay, so we got this bit. We'll have... Uh, Dave, pull that. We'll have Suam come down here. And then Suam's gonna grab this side. Okay. Like that. And then Dave will let go. And then Suam will hold it. And now Suam can let go. Alright. Okay, what do we got here? Just some chains hanging. Alright, so we'll probably have to pull these up. All right, so I have an idea. What if we do this? So we'll have uh, both of them grab it, get up, and then can we go this way? Oh, yeah. Just have them move it over to the side, and then we can swim down, no problem. Okay, I bet you we have to figure out which is the correct ones. Okay, so we'll go like this. That's not right. We'll swap them. There we go. Oh boy. Okay. Um. Interesting. What happened? 
Oh, 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 it changes. Okay, this is gonna be hard. <laughs> okay, so we'll get our, our, our team up right in here, and it looks like we can't stack them on the same thing. So, Suam and Dave. Suam's gonna go a little bit further. Dave's gonna go about right there. And we should be able to do it like that. All right, let's get out of here. Okay, we got a plate now. So we'll get Dave underneath there, and then we'll get Suam right below him. And we'll stack him a little bit better than we did last time. You probably could do that without this thing, but why would you even bother? Okay, so we do have a path to the left there, but I'm gonna keep going up. Let's just see what we got going on. Okay, not a, not see. Oh boy, this is it's so difficult to try to control these guys at the same time. Okay, we'll block that and we'll get this like that. And then let's just drop that there. Okay, Dave, do your thing. Okay, we got the opening. Now let's pick this thing up again. We'll use Dave because uh, it's easier to control. Because we're used to it. Suwam, you gotta get over there, bud. There we go. Okay, and then we'll get Suwam there, and then we'll drop that. Excellent. Whew. Matching my rhythm underwater. Humans aren't as hopeless as they seem. All right. Let's proceed through the door ahead and flip the switch. All right. Oh. Okay. What is that creature? Look at its snout, it's scary! I've seen it before in the Ancient Creature Codex. It's called a Helicorporin, if my memory is correct. But it went extinct 200 million years ago. Maybe it's been trapped in ice and has now been released as the ice melts in this region. That thing is monstrous looking. Oh boy! We've been spotted. What should we do? Suam? Su <laughs> He's out of there. Okay, we got some ammo there in the left corner. Suam's up top, hiding. This place looks strategically important. Since that is an ancient deep sea creature, it won't sense bright light. I will hit a divine tree fruit here to blind it, and you lure the creature. Okay, it sounds like a reasonable tactic, but all you do is just hide, it seems. Anyways, that saw blade looks extremely dangerous. I should either hide somewhere or use a divine tree fruit as Suam suggested. Okay, can we hide down here? Oh, okay. Oh man, it's so fast as well. Okay, we're gonna switch weapons here. Oh, okay, this is a little tricky. Okay, we got a health over here. I need to grab that. This might be a couple a couple of attempts here. Let's get it to attack and then we'll swim around it. It's giving us plenty of time. Well, at least for that first phase. There's probably a second one. Oh, it just opened the door for us. Okay. Praise my strategical brain. It brought us victory, if you say so. Now the monster is gone and we can access the door. Let's go in, human. All right, let's do it. Okay, we are not controlling Suam anymore, but we are going to grab this ammo. And we're going to see what we can do about this guy. The eggs are getting quite full. Got the saw blade and the tail. Okay, cool. It's larger than the one in the second room. Help me, Suwam. Can't do anything without me, human. Ancient contraption. Okay. Let's see. So again, not controlling Suwam. That's that's great. Oh, stop dialing and pull the litter. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. 
together. All right, now that should open this entrance up. Activated the last switch, the door to the control room should be open. I must get out through the exit and see what's going on outside. Check the control room entrance. Alright. Okay, so we're getting pretty late in our recording, so what I think I'm going to do is we're going to head out of here for today. Uh, but then we'll come back in our next episode and we will check out what the heck is in this control room. So thanks for coming and hanging out with me and Dave. I hope you enjoyed this one. And uh, I'll see you on the next episode of Dave the Diver.